Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. This is Mystic Moonbeam Tarot and today I'm doing a collective tea leaf reading for the next 72 hours or whenever you come across this video. Please remember that the messages I give are general and they're not going to resonate with each and every one of you. So as always, just take what fits and leave the rest. Um, I'm also going to pull some out of my card to see if I can clarify the messages or get additional messages for you all. Now, before I get into it, while I was preparing the tea, I seen a shrimp. So, to me, this could mean that someone is finding it hard to face realities in life. And it's making someone want to hide away from the world. But what I was also seeing, that when you come out from hiding, it's like you're going to have the wisdom to tackle the situation. And it's like those around you will be amazed of how you've overcome something. So I'm talking to someone who has isolated themselves away for quite some time. You could have isolated yourself away to recharge. But I feel as if I'm talking to someone who has not been facing problems. But I do see you taking situations head on and being strong enough to face them. I was also seeing the initial SP and R1 and something around a month for these initials. I was also seeing the initials D and G and a stag. And with this, I was seeing harmony and happiness, power and peace. Um, you have some kind of new opportunities coming towards you. So make sure that you utilise them. You're about to succeed at something if you've got the initials D, G. Now, if anyone is a leader of some kind or you have people that look up to you, make sure you... You're adding self-care as well and you're taking care of yourself. Um, I was also picking up on someone. They have a negative person around them who's draining your energy. And the only way to escape this person is to try and show strength in positive thinking. This is someone who likes to control others. And it was it, I was seeing that it is time to distance yourself from this person before you pick up on their negative energies. Because whoever I'm talking to, you have success coming in. And this in, this individual could have, could affect this for you. Um, I was also picking up on unexpected potential, potential change uh, on the way for someone in the form of um, transformation or renewal, where you will change for the better. Um, you will become a new person and become more positive. So expect change to come your way. That could be a, for a few of the collective. I also seen the name Amy and Rach, which is short for Rachel. It could be short for something else. That was showing as well. I also seen an unhappy face as well and crying. This could be in regards to family matters or love. And I was also picking up on someone having uh, problems communicating with others around them as well. So I'm going to get into the messages of the cup and see what I can see. Right, straight away at the top, I'm seeing what looks like a crocodile. Someone needs to be careful. There's someone that's gonna that wants to attack another person. I don't, this could be verbally. It's something around some kind of growth or change that you're going through. This could be someone around you that's seen you change for the better, and I'm seeing like a slight attack, but it's more verbally than physically. So I just need to put that out there. I'm also seeing good luck as well with the elephant. So someone's got a lot of good luck coming in as well. Someone could have just overcome an obstacle, recently overcome an obstacle or a few obstacles, and this is bringing in good luck. There's great luck coming in. And it's like others will be valuing you as well. I've got the initial P. I'm also seeing celebrations coming into someone's life soon because of money or wealth. Yeah, I'm saying someone could have problems with a friend where you may feel attacked. And I do feel that it's because others or this certain friend is jealous of you. I'm also seeing a new job or a career for someone with the, with the initials E and P. First, middle, last name. So just put that to where it fits. I'm also seeing a lot of birds flying as well. So this is news. And it's coming towards the middle of the cup. So this could be within the next 72 hours or just after. 
with it being in the middle of the cup, I class this as the present moment, in the present. So for some, you could have had this news. For others, it's to come. Um, and it's where other people will help. They'll help you move forward on something or on a situation. I'm also picking up as well as someone has gone through some kind of recent change. And it's been positive. This could be regarding childhood or the past. Someone has broken loose or someone is breaking loose from their childhood memories. And it's important to try to remember the happy times that you had rather than the negative times. But I do need to say there's also a need to break free from anyone where your needs are not being met as well. So I don't know if this is, you need to do this or someone has done this or been doing this. Definitely seen some kind of increase of money because of trade that someone does. Someone could also get assistance or useful information. And this is going to bring in new beginnings for you. So you need to prepare yourself for these new beginnings coming in. But you also need to prepare yourself for gossip as well. Someone needs to tie up loose ends. Yeah, someone's got numerous blessings coming in. A fresh start is showing with an opportunity, a brand new opportunity. So there needs to, there needs to be a look into your future and not on your past. I want to say that. Someone could also be feeling as if they're being pulled in two different directions as well. I want to say you need to go with your gut. So it could be that someone's going to be faced with two paths to go down or you feel as if you're stuck in the middle being pulled in two directions. You need to go with your gut. I do see a lot of good things to come in for the collective with new beginnings. But I do need to say that these new beginnings, it could bring in gossip. It could also bring in with it enemies as well. But I do see you will have you will overcome this. And any misfortune or sorrow in your life will be overcome. There has been a focus on difficulties due to other people getting involved in situations. This is changing. There's positive energy that's coming in. And I'm also picking up on something about a mother and father in spirit. So someone's parents, both parents, has passed over, has crossed over. They're sending love and they are around you, making you feel at ease. These parents walk with you when you're out in nature or someone could go on or it could be I could be talking to someone who goes on walks or this couple like to go for walks together in nature. The number 27 with this could be important. I'm also seeing a tap again. I think I've seen this in the last tea leaf reading I did or a tea leaf reading. But there's something... Someone needs to fix a tap and it's underneath the sink area, the bottom half of the tap that lies under lies under a sink or a cupboard. I'm seeing water dripping into a cupboard or there's going to be a leak. So it could be a washer that needs fixing or something underneath the tap needs tightening. I'm seeing a leak or dripping of water. Seeing the initial PP. That could be first, last, middle name. Also got the initial C, it looks like C-R. I'm also seeing a hat at the bottom of the teacup as well. Hat I always um, symbolise with a, um, a change of location. There's also a travel showing for work, a short journey. There's a lot of transformation that's happening for the collective. Big transformation, renewal. It's bringing in a lot of positive energy, new beginnings, opportunities, doors opening up. The choice of more than one or two things. But like I said, just be aware of it's going to be bringing in gossip and enemies. But you need to know that you will overcome this. And it will be positive for you. So I'm going to have a look at the cards. See if I can clarify the messages I've been getting. Or get some additional messages for you. Just bear with me, Let's have a look.
messages for the collective. Let's have a look. Right, we've had two cards that flipped. We have truth is coming out soon. Lies will be exposed. And then we have don't let others control you or your happiness. Put your foot down. I was picking up on that. Um, someone around another that's sucking the life force out of you. They're draining your energy. It's someone that likes to control other people. And it could be that within the next 72 hours or when you come across this video, some kind of lies or truth is going to be exposed about someone that's been controlling you in some way. But this is just clarifying. Don't let others control you or your happiness. Put your foot down. It could be that someone needs to speak up to this certain individual. But, or it could be a separate message. There's definitely some kind of truth that's coming out. Some kind of lies are being exposed about another person or other people. And then we have karma is being served and you will get justice. Yeah, you're protected. Karma's been served with anyone that's done you wrong or treated you unfairly. You will get justice. This could be um, in regards to um, legal matters as well. And then we have a happy event will be happening soon. A social gathering. I've seen celebrations coming in. So this is just clarifying everything I've seen in the cup. There's going to be a happy event that will be happening soon. A social gathering. It could be celebrations after you receive some kind of good news as well, is what I'm getting. You just pick those cards up off the floor. I'll only take the ones that have flipped. We have money material world will get better. I was picking that up in the cup as well. Money and wealth coming in. There could be jealousy and gossip around this as well. There could be celebrations around some kind of money. Or something happening in your material world. It could be a literal move. It could be an addition to a family. A marriage, an engagement. And then we have, I can't stand you. So yeah, there is someone round another person that can't stand you. It could be that they don't like to see you happy. They're trying to stop you from doing good things. But regardless, they'll get their karma. Yeah, and next day, evil eye. This person has got ill intentions towards you. But karma's being served on anyone that tries to come at you. And then we have time to stop isolating yourself. Get out and enjoy yourself. I was picking up on someone that's withdrawn themselves away to reflect. Or like I was saying with the cup, someone not dealing with the realities of life. And I do feel when you do step out and you come out of hermit mode, people are going to be amazed. Because I feel as if you're going to gain so much wisdom and it's going to amaze people. And then we have, I'm supporting you. I'm supporting from a distance. So there's someone that's supporting you from a distance. But this could also be as well with the arrows. There could be some kind of support that comes in for someone to help you move forward. I was also seeing that in the cup as well. And then we have abundance is coming. These are your new beginnings, your opportunities, your fresh starts. They're coming in. And I feel as if no one can affect this. They will try. They will be gossip around this. Um, with any no new opportunities or blessings that come in. You, you do tend to pick up enemies along the way. It's down to jealousy. Do not let, a, let it affect you whatsoever. And then we have everything happens for the right reason. Yeah, it's all happening as it's supposed to be. I want to say divine timing. Then we have a new friendship will be formed. Someone could meet... The soul tribe. Someone could meet a new friend as you move into a new opportunity, whether it's in work, love, um, group. You could join a group. It could be regarding to school, um, college, university, whatever. You could meet your soul tribe. There's a new friendship that's going to be formed. And it's going to be really positive as well. And then we have treat yourself better. Take better care of yourself, self-love. I was picking that up in the cup as well. Especially if you're in a leadership role or you, you do a job or you're a single parent where you've got a lot of responsibilities and people look up to you. Make sure you put self-care self into your, your practice as well. I was going to say the name Claire, so that could mean something. And then we have clear out your friendship circle. There's a snake in the grass, yeah? It's clarifying everything I've seen in the cup. There's an individual around someone that's draining you. 
that likes to control you, control what you do. And it could be a friend. It doesn't have to be. It could be a family member. It could be a partner, a lover, a connection. There's someone around you that, that's draining you. They're a snake. They've got ill intentions towards you. You need to distance yourself from a certain individual. And get a couple more. We have Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. So you could be a Cancer, Pisces or Scorpio that needs to clear out your friendship circle or get rid, distance yourself from a certain individual. Or this person is a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. But we'll see what else comes out. Yep. There we go. Number one, new opportunity doors opening for you. I've seen that in the cup as well. And this could be around a Cancer Pisces Scorpio or it could be in Cancer Pisces or Scorpio um, season. Cancer season is, um, is it June, July? Pisces is February, March. Scorpio is now. We're in Scorpio season. Um, is it now? I'd say, yeah, October, November. There's something new coming in. Put that to where it resonates. Someone has a secret admirer from the past, a missed opportunity. I could be talking to a Cancer Pisces Scorpio, or it could be one of these signs, or it could be a new opportunity, someone coming back from the past. In Scorpio season, I'm being drawn to Scorpio season, which is now in November. And then we have take responsibility for your own actions, the blame game. So there could be someone blaming another person. And then we are, I've seen this in the cup as well. Have a good cry. It's well needed. I was picking up on someone. I've seen a sad face uh, and someone crying. This, Like I said, it could be regarding family matters or love. Or someone's just bottling up emotions. Someone needs to have a good cry because it's well needed. And then we have someone who's thinking negative about you, wear protection, yeah? It's this evil light, this certain individual around someone. I'm just going to get a couple more. And then we have it's over and done with, so someone needs to hear that message. Let me just pick up the card dropped. Something is over and done with. It could be that you need to distance yourself from a certain individual because... The cycle's over and done with. Something is over and done with. It could also be troubles as well. Any problems or difficulties you've been going through. And then we have someone can't stop thinking about you. So it could be someone from the past. Someone could have a fake account and be stalking another person. And then we have Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. And I hate to see you happy. I was in your life. And trust is called for. Have faith. So just be aware of... A certain individual, especially if you feel drained around this person, you will know when you're around this person. It could be someone that wants you to do things their way. Um, you could get lower back pain when you're around this person. Tension around the head as if your head's being pressed. Um, you could have anxiety. Or when this person leaves your energy, you could just feel really tired, drained. You will know who this is. So I'm going to leave those messages with you and I hope that helped and thank you all for watching.